What's up, Wise Flyers? David here. In this video, I'm going to go over the three best credit cards to use when shopping at Costco to maximize those purchases and get the most value out of it so you get more cash back in your wallet. If you're like me, you spend a ton of money at Costco because you're getting a ton of value by saving, by buying everything in bulk. And it's really important that you're getting more than one point for every dollar spent at Costco. You don't want to leave any money on the table. So let's get right into this list. First card is the Chase Freedom Unlimited card. This card offers 3% cash back on every single purchase made up to the first $20,000 in the first year. After that, it's 1.5 cents or 1.5% back on every transaction. And the best way to get value out of this card is if you take those Chase Ultimate Reward Points you're earning and transfer it over to either the Chase Sapphire Preferred, Chase Sapphire Reserve, or Chase Inc. Preferred because you'll be able to use these points for transfer partners. So with that first year, you could really maximize that 3% back and it's no annual fee. So every year after that, you'll get 1.5% back. You also get 3% cash back at restaurants worldwide and 3% back on travel, on certain travel purchases such as flights, hotels, and even car rentals. And on every other purchase, you'll earn 1% cash back and there is no annual fee with this card. So if you shop at Costco, this is a really Really good option and if you want to apply for any of these cards mentioned in the video you could click the link down in the description below and by using our links you help support the channel to keep making awesome content for you and it's still free the next card would be the US Bank Altitude Reserve Card. So this card offers 50,000 points after spending $4,500 in the first three months, and it does have an annual fee of $400. If you're new to credit cards, that $400 annual fee may sound crazy, but stick with me, I'll show you how you could get a lot of value out of this card. With this card, you'll earn three points per dollar spent on travel purchases, and most importantly, mobile wallet purchases such as Apple Pay or Samsung Pay. This is the key to how you get the most value out of Costco because Costco just installed the mobile pay units on every single uh, credit card portal at every single store. So if you do have Samsung Pay, Apple Pay, you could use that to get 3% on every transaction. It's one point per dollar on all other purchases, but with this $400 annual fee, you get a $325 travel credit every year. So that essentially brings the annual fee down to $75. So what else are you getting with this $75 annual fee after the credit? You're getting Priority Pass Airport Lounge Access. So this is four entries per year for you and one guest. If you haven't experienced lounge access in airports, definitely you have to try it out. It, it'll change your airport experience completely. So this is a good perk. Plus you also get 12 free GoGo in-flight Wi-Fi passes per calendar year and also global entry at, or TSA pre-check, which is a $100 credit, which is good for up to four years. So you could cut that security line. Now, when you make your purchases at Costco to get that 3% back or the three points per dollar spent at Costco when you use mobile pay, that's really good. But where the real value with this card is, is you get 1.5 cents toward travel when you make travel purchases. So essentially, if you're going to use your points for travel, you're going to get 1.5% back. So with the three points per dollar, you're essentially earning 4.5 points per dollar spent when shopping at Costco. Any travel provider you like and redeem your points using the US Bank real-time reward. You do not have to book through US Bank to use your travel reward. So there is a lot of flexibility, flexibility here and there's a great earning potential. So this annual fee may seem a little steep, but if you could get a lot of value, get that three points per dollar spent or even 4.5 points per dollar spent at Costco, this US Bank Altitude Reserve will give you a lot of money back. 
So I'm curious to hear what you think. Which card are you using when you're shopping at Costco? Put in the comments down below. And of course, the next card is the City Costco Visa card. This is pretty straightforward. You're going to get 2% back on every single Costco purchase that you make. You also get 4% cash back on the first $7,000 of purchases each annual reward period, 1% after that at gas stations at Costco and gas stations worldwide. So, but this does exclude supermarkets and uh, superstores and convenience stores, kind of like the Walmart neighborhood stores have their own gas stations. Those are excluded from it. So the only drawback with this City Costco card is that the way to redeem your points that you earn, you only get it back in a check that you get one time per year. So if you're gonna make a bunch of purchases and you're going to Costco and let's say you have the uh, the executive membership, you're getting 2% back on anything, on everything anyway, and you're getting that check at the end of the year, same with the City Costco Visa card, you're getting that 2% back that you're earning throughout the year just in a one-time check, which you're most likely gonna spend at Costco anyway. As I mentioned before, it's really important to not just get one point per dollar spent when shopping at Costco because you're probably spending hundreds of dollars a month at Costco and to only get hundreds of points is just a waste. As I mentioned with the with the US Bank Altitude Reserve card, you could get 4.5 points per dollar spent if you're going to make travel redemptions with those points. Otherwise, 3% cash back on the first year with the Chase Freedom Unlimited or just stick with the city, the standard city Costco card and get 2% back on all your purchases. Combine that with the executive membership, you're getting 4% back. And if you want to watch other videos on cashback credit cards for other purchases, you could click this playlist here. It talks about other cashback credit cards that I think you would really enjoy. You could click that link now and I'll see you in the next video.